Hi, y'all. <clears throat> Alright, I'm back. I had to take... I took a day off to gather my thoughts, to start being a lot more... a lot more... What's the word I'm looking for? Thoughtful or particular about my words and what I say. Um and how I talk about a project because things have gotten twisted and I do not want things to be twisted. I do not want any feelings being hurt thinking I'm talking about this, that, or the other. Um, so, you know, I just needed a day to myself where I'm like, a break and just chill. So, I'm going to try to be a lot more conscious of what I say, I guess. Is that what I'm looking for? I don't know the words. I don't know the words I'm wanting to say. But, um, anyway. So, I'm working on a project. The trilogy, Halloween. show you where I'm at. Now I feel like I wasted a big piece of fabric because I used that fabric calculator and it said that I need this big old piece of fabric. These things ain't, uh, these blocks are 30 by 30. Why do I need a big old piece of fabric? This was a total waste of fabric. Because now I've got to search around to see if I can find something that will fit down here. I don't know. I don't get it. But it's turning out really cute. I've only got one more square to do and that's the little witch. And then I guess I'll find something to put on the bottom. Because the squares are only two inches. And it said I need a, a 10 or 19 by 10 piece of fabric. Um, why do I need that big of a fabric? I don't know. But you can see the coffee tea, the coffee dye I put on it to grunge it up a little bit. But it just doesn't make sense. Because I could have put it on one of my scrap pieces. Instead of using up a good piece. So I'm going to have to find a pattern to, uh, to put on the bottom. Because I've got all of that to use. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe I can find a little Halloween house and do it or something. I don't I don't know exactly what the answer is for that. But anyway. Oh, and the needle minder is made from a good friend. Such beautiful. I love when y'all make me stuff. Y'all are just so much talent. So much talent. But that's all I've been doing, and uh, like I said, all i got left is the little witch. So, if you are watching me, I don't know if I'm going to give this away or not. I think I may do it again. But there's a possibility I might give this away. I don't know. Let me get moved, and I'll decide on that. Because it's my, it's a pattern I had. It's not a gift. It was a pattern I had. And so, you know. Um, catch, watching some floss tube today. And hopefully, the WoW Classic Fever is over with. Because I watch a lot of live stream, gaming live stream on Twitch TV. And, um. Uh, even my girl Fertini's out there. She's so sweet. I love her. I love watching her. I don't say much in your chat or anything, but I watch you. Yes, I do. Um, 
WoW released classic version, which was way the original version of WoW. I'm not a WoW player. I've always been a Diablo girl. Uh, so, what am I trying to say? I think, I think everybody has jumped on that bandwagon of WoW, and it's like, can anybody play something a little bit different? <laughs> Why are we all jumping on the WoW bandwagon? But I don't understand WoW. I don't get it. Um, I'm not a big fan. But a lot of people still don't understand how Diablo's going. Because Diablo's been around for a very long time. And I've been there since the beginning. And I love it. I love Diablo. I just wish I had the internet to play it. Um, I've got internet or Wi-Fi, but not strong enough Wi-Fi to run it. And then I've got, I won a game called The Last Epoch, E-P-O-C-H. I haven't been able to play it because of the internet. So there's a couple of things I want to do, but I haven't been able to do. So maybe one day I'll find me a strong Wi-Fi. Maybe. The new place is supposed to have Wi-Fi. Uh, on the update on that, there's a possibility I'll be going Saturday. But I don't know if that'll happen or not. Um... Uh, if not, I'm going to, have to go on the third. Uh, I contacted the mover and let him know, hey, there's a possibility on Saturday, but if they don't show again, then I'm going to uh, do it on the third. So, and we'll get moved over there. And like I said, my dad's going to help out and get me all over there. And hopefully everything goes smoothly. Let's hope everything goes smoothly. And, uh,. Get over there and settle back down. And I'm going to try to get a storage unit. And uh, shove all the shit in the storage unit. And get it decluttered. Because I hate my house like it is right now. It's such a mess. But you don't realize how much stuff you've got to pull off walls and everything. And, and set down. and Because everything's going to crash and burn. when you, As soon as you move this rig... It's all going to start wiggling and wobbling, and it's going to crash and burn. So, I got to get everything put on the floor. And even then, it's not a guarantee it's going to stay put. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm going to go find some coffee and start on this witch chicka. <sighs> oh, sorry. She's so cute. Look at her little face. Now, if you saw all my, all my things, this is a back stitch right here that I did not get done. This is a back stitch thing that did not get done. And I'm not going to do it. And I know it seems like it's pretty easy, but I'm not about to do that. And then all I got is her little face. Isn't that cute? I've been having to do a lot of DMC substitution conversions. Um, it gives you the conversion on the chart. Like here focus but um I, I still don't have because see I don't have a master set so it's hard for me to find the right DMC uh, but one day I will and I've learned the hard way that I hate my I hate them on bobbins I hate that because they have those wrinkles in them the creases and so when I went to doing it this way, this is the way I prefer. Usually I have a whole skein in here. Um, but this somehow may have got tangled, so I wrapped it up. But this is the way I prefer to do it, is in these baggies. Because this just, these just leave that crease marks. See how it's all creased up? And I hate that, and I wish I would have known not to do that. Um... But you live and learn. So, anyway, guys, I'm going to quit rambling. I love y'all. Take care. Spread peace, love, and kindness.